Hello, everyone, and thank you for coming back to the channel. Ain't no sense of telling you where you at. You know where you at. That's why you clicked on. So we ain't going to give any homage to it. We know where you stand. We know where you are. So let's get to it. Celebrity Insider brought out another salacious story for me to partake of. And I thought I would tell it to you all. My spin. My expert opinion. Okay, if everybody can be CEOs and OOCs and OOLs and whatever, self-proclaimed, then I'm going to self-proclaim myself as an expert opinionated person who gives expert opinions on reviews or anything I want to review something on. Okay, or said person. All right. So getting that out of the way before we start. Okay. The story comes from a journalist or an employee staff member over at Celebrity Insider. His name is Nick Marcus, so let's throw up the hands for him, okay? He put out the video today, all right, 10.35 a.m. Pacific Standard Time Zone, okay? Yes, he got 33. Well, he got my daughter's birthday, March 31st, 331 views. Now, I'm sure it went higher than uh, what I'm expressing now, but it just is what it is. Check him out. He threw out some good work. All right. I guess he's setting us up, basically telling us what's going to happen in the first couple of episodes. The drama is going to be sitting around three people. Portia Williams, Kenya Moore, and of course, none other than the OG, NeNe Leakes. Everybody got to get their feel of her. And it's good drama. It's good drama. It's good talked about drama, I should say. Because we don't want to start it off talking about Cynthia Bailey and her wedding. No, that's a happy thing. I'm so boring at tech, but it is what it is, right? But he goes on to break the story. The title says, Portia Williams and Kenya Moore's Beef with NeNe Leakes. Season 12 of Real Housewives of Atlanta filled with drama between them. I'm against them three, okay? I guess that's how they're going to bring us back with a little action. Because it ain't really no action. If you ain't got Nene involved somewhere, somehow, okay, she's an OG. Respect her game, all right? As long as she ain't whining and caring on it, want people to support her and this, that, and that her with emotions. But Nene also tear down people. So it's kind of hard to be on her team solely, 100%, when she do messed up stuff like that, okay? So, moving on, the article reads as such. It sounds like the new Real Housewives of Atlanta season will be filled with drama and most of it because of constant feud of Kenya Moore and Portia Williams with NeNe Leakes, okay? Number 12, means, meaning season 12, will undoubtedly, undoubtedly be a dramatic one since the ladies' beef is far from over. Of course it's far from over. Y'all manufactured the storyline, okay? Do we really think y'all care about each other? Y'all go out and hang out with each other. We know that's a false. Okay, so you're just playing in the playhouse, the big playground they got y'all on, so y'all can make this mindless drama for us to partake of. We get enjoy, we enjoy the drama. And y'all make the money. Okay, but do we think y'all got a real relationship going on? No, nope. because real relationships are not formed on television. <laughs> okay, not when it's a mess going on. The only thing y'all giving us is what we paying for, or I should say, tuning in for, and dro uh, Bravo or True Entertainment are paying y'all for. Y'all getting up here on this mindless show, filling our heads with mindless stuff, so we can separate and detach away from our lives. Okay? Just for, just for an hour or so. Anyway. So it's good all the way around. We ask for it. Y'all deliver it. Getting back to the article, it says... Um, one source tells Hollywood Life that Kenya and Portia would never see eye to eye with Nene. Of course they won't. Because they don't uh, made this, I don't know how true it is, a bond with both of them being mothers. They having play dates with their little girls. And they're trying to foster some type of relationship where they don't have to go at each other's throats. But more than likely, if it ain't in season 12, I'm sure it'll be in season 13. Kenya and Portia are going to be feuding with one another. Watch. Watch it. That's all I'm going to say. Watch for it. Might be sooner than that. Because they were at each other's throats. Do we remember? 
do we remember when Portia snatched Kenya? Okay. And had to uh, pin her down to the floor and wouldn't let her go. Then they basically had to pin Portia down to the floor and wouldn't let her go. Okay. That's how she got sent to that management, um, anger management class. Okay, because Portia can't keep her hands to herself. All right. Going from there, it says, however, they stress that there's no reason to worry and other ladies will end up exiting the show as a result of their fighting. Yes, because I'm sure all of it was verbal. <laughs> they are too invested in their livelihoods now to be sitting trying to catch an assault charge and get behind them little bars, okay? Just going to keep them away from their babies, all right? They can be kept away from their men, but they can't be kept away from their babies. Ooh, even though I'm sure the grandparents would do a good job while they're in solitary confinement in the uh, Fulton County Jailhouse, I'm sure the grandparents would step up and play their part. So they can think about getting them out of jail or should they get them out of jail. Hell, it might be good drama for Bravo to be filming them behind bars, okay? Just for a weekend or so, that's all. Or maybe a 24-hour zone, that's all I'm saying. That will blow the ratings through the roof and I'm sure it will make a good bargaining chip when it's time for them to go back to the negotiation table for the next season. You get my drift? Okay. Now, it goes back to the article it says, the source is that one of them is Eva Marcel and that her unwillingness to stay away from the other three feud led to Nene's leaks not talking to her for a while. Well, hell, she was mad at Nene and I think it was season 10. Or it could have been 11 when Nene caught herself being mic'd up. And I think that was probably season, shit, I don't know, I'm not even going to lie. But she was mad at Nene for sitting up there trying to get a secret behind the storyline or uh, Eva and her personal life and what she was experiencing and Nene trying to bring it to the forefront which Nene was wrong, y'all know she was wrong, but anyway Nene tried to get her pun played but didn't really work out the way Nene wanted to because we didn't really get no good tea, you know so moving on from there but will they manage to get over their differences and start a newest pile? The insider tells the news outlet that at this point, making peace between Portia, Kenya, and Nene is pretty much close to impossible. Of course, because too many people after Nene. They can fight with her for so long, then Nene will pick up a fight with somebody else, okay? That's just how Nene rolls. She can pick a fight with every last one of them ladies and, and drag it out for the whole season, and it'll be cool. Because one thing she does have is Marlo Hampton over there, and Marlo Hampton feels with all the girls. But Marla Hampton, she can all just be in with her pretty much and get all the tea and be dogging them in one uh, play. You see what I'm saying? No flag on play. Because Nene always going to have her day. Right? Okay. Then it goes on to say, even though there have been reports that Nene has been going around being a peacemaker when it comes to these two, she has no interest in repairing much with them. But the same can be said about Kenya and Portia. This season's gearing up to be really, really a really good one. And that's what they're saying. That's what they're trying to tell us. Who we know, hey. You got to give us a little something to keep us fascinated with the season coming back. And a little drama. Then it gets boring for four or five, or maybe I just say four episodes. Then it'll get back more juicier. But if you don't have Nene in there somewhere, <laughs> please, it'll be dry as the Sahara Desert. Okay, because we got to have her starting stuff throwing rocks and hiding her hands and all of that. But we certainly don't need Nene coming in playing like she's victim. That ain't the Nene I like. That's not the Nene I want to see play. But that ain't really her character. Okay? She got enough of that. We got enough of that. We don't want that uh, appetizer anymore. No. No. Take it back. Don't want it. Send it back to the shelf. Come to me out something new. Okay? I'm not, I'm not wanting that dish anymore. I want another appetizer. Okay? But that's all it was with that. It was short and sweet. So I kept it short and sweet, as you can see. And we'll look forward to that first episode of season 12 coming out real soon to us. Hopefully, I'm thinking in September. Maybe the second week of September. Okay? But y'all be blessed, y'all. I'll see y'all for another video. And until then, peace.